Lynette Charles. All right, Christian, let's start you out this morning. Satellite and radar, we are uh, waiting for more snow, some rain coming in, but some spots already dealing with that this morning. As we go through the rest of today, rain, snow will be on tap. Bottom line, though, snow not accumulating out there. It's just going to look like winter and feel like winter as well. Once again, we will have some rain coming in, and that's exactly what we're seeing. That mixture happening around Charles Manor, around Bel Air this morning. We're seeing this around Joppa Town as well. Glen Arm getting in on this, and then we hop over back off towards the west. Westminster, Uniontown, Eldersburg. Some of this may be touching the ground at this point. So again, we'll continue to monitor this with you as we go throughout the day. You can see, though, that counterclockwise spin. That is that area of low pressure that will continue to try to fill in as we go throughout the day. We will have a cold front, colder air coming in through the area as well. If you're traveling to take you down off towards the south this morning, you're running into more of a warmer air mass there. So that's why you're seeing just plain rain across that area. But if your travels are taking you off to the north, oh yeah, definitely going to be running into some snow and that snow is going to be heavy as well. Those accumulations really getting up there. So a winter storm warning is definitely in effect for those areas there shaded in the pink coloring back here at home. We're not dealing with any type of warnings out there, not even advisory. So that's definitely some good news. That means that travel is pretty much not going to be impacted today. No winter weather advisories in terms of the temperatures. We have these numbers coming in right around 33 degrees in Owings Mills. So that number has fallen since the last time I showed you this. It's 34 degrees right now in Lutherville, Hamden. We're seeing the same thing around Lock Hearn this morning, and it's 36 degrees right now in Dundalk. Rosedale's at 35, more of the same in Chestertown this morning. Good morning, Cecil Tim. You're coming in at 34. So not only do we have the rain, the snow showers out there for today, we also are going to be dealing with the wind. Can't get rid of that wind. I left you over the holiday with the wind, and I'm returning with the wind as well. So the breezy conditions will stick around for today and also for tomorrow. The future cast goes into motion, picking up on the greens and the pinks and the purples. So yes, the rain, snow showers will continue as we go through the morning hours and possibly maybe even wrapping around this afternoon evening time frame. But then we'll start to get some drier time as we head in through the work week. So here's the seven day forecast for you. As I step out of the way, we can see temperatures will be right around 50 degrees as we work our way towards Wednesday, but we will get more sunshine in the forecast starting on your Tuesday. Again, the breeze is sticking around on your Tuesday and then we get cool as we head into next week. That temperature next weekend, I should say temperature on Saturday right around 43. Megan Knight over to you. Okay.